Hello and welcome to another Lawson Estate Agents video viewing. We're here today to see a really lovely detached park home on the outskirts of Tavistock. We're in the Silent Woman Park um, on the outskirts of Tavi. Uh, very sought after location, lovely rural spot and if I stop talking long enough as a silent woman you can hear all birds tweeting in the background. Um, so we're here to see this particular park home. As you can see, the site here is a nice, small, exclusive residential, all round residential year, um, all year round rather, residential park. Um, and it really is in the most beautiful spot. You're only a couple of miles out of Tavistock itself. Regular bus routes that come down through um, from the, the Princetown route. Um, so you've got links in and out of Tavistock as well. Um, so it's so nice and accessible. I'll take you around the outside of the property first and then we'll take shoes off and head in. So uh, the property stands on quite a nice sized plot. You've got garden that sort of wraps all the way around and you've got one parking space that comes with, but there is the option to pay additional for a second parking space. Um, so we'll head on around this way. As you can see, this little garden area at this end is a real sun trap. It's sort of about half past four in the afternoon at the moment and we are in full sun. Um, the garden is kind of southeast facing. Um, so this part here at the end is south facing. Um, so this does get the, uh, the most sun. Nice storage area there. And then as you come around the corner, we've got an area laid to sort of AstroTurf. Um, coming along the back of the property, we are right onto the woodland at the back. So really nice and rural, but these trees don't sort of give too much shade um, out here. And then over the back of the fence, you can see down the bottom there, there's a lovely little stream running along behind as well, which is really nice, really sweet. Um, you can just see them down there through the uh, through the trees, little stream trickling along behind. Um, coming back into the garden, <laughs> we've then got another little gate that we step up to. Area laid to composite decking, all out the back of here, so nice and hard wearing, easy to clean. As you can see, you've got patio doors that lead off from the property. And then, uh, unfortunately, not having been turned on for me, um, but we've got a hot tub in the corner. Now, the hot tub obviously doesn't stay, um, but it definitely shows that you've got the space to incorporate, you know, as so they've done a little bit of a gazebo over the top for, you know, a bit of privacy, what have you, but um, a really nice spot. And then you've got steps leading down and a gate leading out to the front as well. So you've got access all the way around the property. So I'm gonna go back around to the front and we can head on in through the main front door. So back into the sun trap, mind the glare, and then back around out to the front of the property. So there is parking to the front. Um, as I say, one, one vehicle currently, but there is the option to uh, pay additional for a second vehicle. So as we then come up a couple of steps at the front, we come on in to sort of open plan main living space really. Your hard floor throughout in here and then nice carpets in the bedroom. This particular park home is only about a year old um, and it's been done to a really, really high specification. So as you come on through, we are living area to this end. As you can see, you've got sort of nice open storage to that side, which keeps that flow of light through, which is really lovely. Plenty of space for a couple of sofas and a coffee table, etc. here, and we're carpeted to this end as well. Nice big picture window to one side again, overlooking the trees beyond. And then we open up to dining space and obviously patio doors lead into the outside space as well. Um, the kitchen is off to the right hand side there. We've got a run of uh, sort of breakfast bar space. So it's a, a really good sort of separating breakfast bar area there. Apologies for the uh, gunshots of the TV in the background. Um, sink unit in there. Obviously all your appliances are integrated. Gas hob um, and another really nice full size window. One of the biggest things you do notice with this property is the flow of light through is really good. Um, hallway down through, we then come to main bedroom. 
So nice size bedroom again. You've got a nice long window to the side there. Run of wardrobes all along one end, and then we are ensuite shower room to the end. So obviously basin, WC, and then a really generous size shower unit to that end. So good size ensuite coming through. Coming back through the main bedroom, we then circle left to the second bedroom. So again, another double size bedroom. Your dual aspect windows in this one, so really sunny room. Um, but as you can see at the moment, they've got it set up as two single beds, but could easily accommodate a double. And then you have the benefit of built-in wardrobes and storage to that end. Coming back along again, we are then through to main bathroom. So again, finished to a nice high spec, all done in nice sort of modern clean style. And then tucking around the corner, we've got a full size bath with mains fed shower over as well. So this is number 15A Silent Woman Park. If you would like more information about the property, or to arrange a viewing, do please give our office a call. Um, the only sort of real restriction here with Silent Woman Park is occupiers need to be over the age of 45 um, and purchasers of park homes um, need to be in a cash buying position. Um, you can get some kinds of loans for them, but typically they are not a mortgage. Um, so cash buying position over the age of 45. Um, but if you meet the requirements and you'd like to come and take a look, please do give us a call on 791 333. Thank you.